Okay, uh, the Stringham model one correlation is based on the Gumpert's model, which is mortality equals uh, initial mortality and uh, the exponential increase of, uh, uh, over time. So there are two parameters here in Gumpert's model, the Gumpert's coefficient g and the initial mortality m0. So and look at uh, the so if we take a log of m0 and it's proportionally correlated to the g and I negatively that's the negative correlation so basically in a plot uh, if I do a plot, that's a log uh, of uh, m0, and that's a g. And how, how is the curve going to look like it's negative? Is it going this way or this way? Yeah, it's this way. Yeah, so. OK, that's basically what it means. Uh, the negative correlation between log of initial mortality rate and the uh, uh, Gumpert's coefficient. So, Think about this, uh, when the G is large, that means shorter lifespan. When M0 is large, it also means shorter lifespan. So if you look at this correlation, let's say for this point here, this one going to have a small G, but uh, large M0. So the, but let's say the, the algorithm try to have a longer lifespan, it try to uh, minimize the initial mortality rate. So it's going to decrease this but decrease the initial mortality. But once it decrease, it's actually the, the Gumpert's coefficient will increase. So if you try to decrease this, this will increase. So it's still going to have relatively the same average lifespan. This is what it means. There is a trade-off between the two Gumpert's parameters. Yeah.